how to design a clothing brand website using shopify hey guys welcome back in this video i am giving you a tutorial on how you can design your own brand website using shopify if you have a clothing store and you're struggling with the design you want to create a high quality professional store this video is for you so let's get into the process first of all what you need to do is you're going to go to shopify.com and you're going to create your own store if you already have created a store we will be focusing on customizing and designing our store today so this is our main admin you can see this is my main admin right here too this is like a completely new store and i have not designed my store yet i have a clothing brand and i want to design my brand and i want to design my website according to that so for that we're going to actually go to our sales channel here and you'll be able to see the online store now this is our storefront and this is the website that we have on Shopify. So once you select the online store, you'll get different options. You will get themes, blog posts, pages, navigation, and preferences. So the first thing that you need to do is when it comes to designing your own store on Shopify, you need to select the right theme. Under online store, we have themes and it will take you right here. So you can see the current theme that we have selected. This is actually the default theme on Shopify. So this one is going to be Dawn. Now Dawn is actually a really good theme to get started with as a beginner. And this one is actually good for a clothing brand. But what you can do is you can scroll down a little bit to check some of the popular free themes and even the paid themes on Shopify. So I'm going to click on visit theme store and show you some of the clothing uh, brand and clothing store themes. So you will have a better idea and you can see which one aligns with your brand. So this is our theme library and now you can actually select if you want to go with the free ones or the paid ones. And then we have industry in industry you're going to scroll down and select clothing now this will customize the best templates for you best themes out there for a clothing store so you can see we have spotlight which is a free theme uh, broadcast dawn which is again free impulse origin symmetry these are all clothing uh, templates and themes so this is the first thing that you need to choose because theme plays an important part in displaying your website so we have selected this one which is dawn this one is also really good for a clothing store once you have selected your theme you're gonna click on customize and this is our storefront at the top here we have all of our pages when it comes to a clothing store and a website you will have your home page product page collections collection list pages if you want to add the blog page you can add it or you can delete these pages then we have of course cart checkout uh, classic customer accounts and others so these are all of the pages that we're getting with this theme at the top here, we have these three dots that allow us to even edit the code of the theme, edit the default theme content, view, view documentation, and more. At this side of the screen, I'll be able to now customize the appearance of my store. So we're going to select the home page and I'll show you how we customize it. In our home page, we have an announcement bar. This is my story name. We have this image banner. So when it comes to a clothing store and this theme, you can see we will actually have to, you know, add like these huge images to attract our audience so this is the first thing we have an image banner select the image banner click on select image and this is where you will upload the image from your computer any model shoot that you have done or your clothes uh, you know your uh, brand shoot you will simply upload the images right here so I have added my image banner here and you can see this is our main image and it looks pretty good. If I want to edit the image a little bit, if I feel like, okay, I need to adjust the size, maybe add some filter, get a preview, we can do that very easily. So now we have this banner image. Here inside our banner image, we have the text that we can add. So this is our main, you know, heading. And in this heading, I actually want to add my brand name because we are actually building a brand here. We're creating a high quality website. So you need to enter your brand name here very clearly. So I'm going to quickly do that like so. Now this is my brand name and we can go with the size of the heading. I'm going to keep it too large. Uh, once you do that, then this block will be edited as well. And now we have this banner image and then we have the store name. Then we have this button which says shop all. If I want to, you know, get rid of the button, I can or I can customize the button. Now, this one says shop all and this one has the link to my product page. 
So this one is actually uh, good. Uh, whenever someone will land on my website, they will just simply click on shop now and they will be taken to my product pages. But I'm going to customize the button a little bit and it says shop all. And I want to say shop now. So I'm going to click on enter and it will be customized. Okay, so this is our banner image here. We have my store. The next step is the featured products and the featured collection. When it comes to your clothing store, you need to actually showcase your featured products and the best products you have right here. Now, this is where you will add your featured collection. Click on featured collection and you can give it a name. For instance, I'm not going to go with the word featured products here, but I'm going to go with my best sellers because these are very good products that we have and I want to showcase them. A uh, heading size is small, but I can go with the medium one. We can even add more details here. And this is where we will add our collection. Click on change. And this is where you can change your collection, remove your collection. Now, you have to actually create your collection within your admin. Uh, you know how to create a collection. There are already videos on this channel on how to actually get started with a store. So if you already have a store, you will have collections, you will have featured collections created, then you can add them right here. So adding a featured collection is really important to customizing your brand website. Moving on, we can add more sections. Click on add section here and we can add collection list rich text, image banner again, or a slideshow. So I personally really like a slideshow on a website because it showcases different, you know, model images. And this gives your website this view of, you know, like, very uh, a brand view it's not just a store on shopify it becomes a brand and the more customized your home page is going to be the more uh, audience and the more customers it will attract so in this image slide what i can do is i can add the button label or i can just simply upload different images this is where you can upload even the slideshow of some of the images um, three images are allowed here so we can go to the image slide select the images and it will be right here so i'm going to quickly do that so here I have uploaded my images and now you can see we have a slideshow and we have um, two images added in this slideshow. So now we have two images and I can like go to the other image. This is the first one and then we have the second image. Uh, when it comes to this slideshow, we can even add some text here. I have added like my brand name again for the heading and then we can even add like a tagline or something. And I added my tagline here for my store again we can add a button here so the main focus of the home page is to actually take our customers to our product page and to our collection pages so you need to add the links to your product and collection pages on your home page so uh, you can see slides all have been also added so now it actually looks pretty good we have this a huge banner image here you will get your featured collections here and then you have even have a slideshow I can move to my other pages such as my product page. So uh, even customizing your product page is really important of your clothing brand. And this is where you will add all of your products. And you just have to create the products within your admin and you'll be able to then, you know, add them here. Customizing on Shopify is really easy. You can add different sections and blocks uh, from here. You can even go to the footer. So this is the footer of my website, which is pretty simple for now. Um, you can add more things here into the footer. You can change the color scheme and even add the email sign up then we're going to go to the theme settings here and this is where you can even change the typography of your store you can change the logo you can change the colors um, buttons inputs now make sure to change the colors and the typography because um, this kind of like makes your store stand out because there are going to be a lot of different stores on the same theme created on the same theme so what you're going to do is you can even upload your logo here, go to colors and you can change the color scheme of your whole website and align it according to your brand. Maybe your brand deals in different color, nude colors, then you will be able to change them. If your brand deals in very vibrant colors, you will be able to even change the colors from here. Then we have our collections card, blog cards and more. You can even, uh, you know, uh, check the media from here. We can add different badges, icons and I'll do a lot more when it comes to customizing our own clothing website. Once you're done with all of these settings, make sure to hit save at the top here so that all of the changes that you have done will be saved. Now we can actually go back or we can get actually a preview. So it will show you the live preview of your website as well. Or even if you want to view it, then you can just click on view and it will show you the store that you're customizing. This is what our store looks like. You can see at the top, 
we have our pages and this is where we have our banner image it's just gonna take a second to load and then we have even like our slideshow that we added so the home page actually looks really good now you can see this is the page that we just customized and this way you can also go ahead and customize your clothing brand website on shopify i hope that i was a big help don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to youtube channel